I see that you're doing very well. <laughs> you're looking very well. Welcome I back to my channel. I am Keisha Jabri, and today y'all will be getting in my business. Okay, y'all gonna get to know a little bit more about me and who I am. So I'm gonna be doing the T in my tag, and that means too much information. Yeah, y'all finna be in my business. So I wanted to get comfortable, you know, in my bed, in my comfy clothes. Do not mind my messy dresser. That's why, you know, put on my little makeup or whatever whatever yeah so let's go ahead and get right into the video because this is going to be a lengthy video so if you are interested to see what i'm all about and things of that nature then just keep watching so, question number one is what am i currently wearing i'm wearing this onesie i don't know where it came from um it's, it's shorts y'all can't see it but it's shorts it's attached to the top i don't know where it came from and i'm wearing this necklace from H&M, yeah, H&M. Question number two, have you ever been in love? No, <laughs> no. I thought I was in love, but I wasn't in love for real. Yeah, I wasn't in love. Question number three, have you ever had a terrible breakup? Yes. I mean, it wasn't really terrible because like I'm a calm person, especially when I'm mad. That's, that's so backwards, but when I'm mad, I'm really calm. So it wasn't really like terrible, terrible, but it wasn't a good way to end off a relationship, if that makes sense. How old am I? I'm so sick of people commenting, asking this question, so I finally get to tell you guys how old I am. I am 15. I'm 15 years old. Yes, 15. How tall are you? I gotta be somewhere in between five, six. Yeah, I gotta be like five, six. Number seven, do I have any piercings? Um, I have two holes in both of my ears. I don't really use the second hole. I had a little. I've had it since I was 11 or 10, something like that. I've had them for a really long time, but I don't use them. Do I have any tattoos? No, I don't have any tattoos. I am 15. I don't think, you know, most 15 year olds have tattoos, but I don't know. What's your favorite drink? My favorite drink is, I don't know, I just like juice. Like, any good type of juice, like Powerade or like Mini Maid or anything of that sort, I I can deal with it. Like, I love juice. I don't have a favorite, though. What's my favorite song? Right now, my favorite song has to be... Oh. So what cause we don't know? Yeah, that's my favorite song. It's called We Don't Love Them by um, Hood Rich Pablo Juan. So, yeah. So, don't comment asking me what's the name of that song because I just said it. I'm going to put it on the screen and everything. And, y'all, do not come for my nails. Please do not come for my nails. I got three nails left. Yes, three nails. They all hurt. They will not come off. I've tried just about everything. It just won't come off. So, I don't know. What's my zodiac sign? I am a cancer. So you should really read up on cancers because you know we are, you know, amazing people. You should read up on it. Question number 12 is how long does it take you to shower? It depends on what all I got to do up in there. It just depends because if I got to do my hair, and which most of the time I do, it's going to take me at least 20 minutes in the shower. But if I got to like shave or anything like that, it should only take me like 15. So. What's my favorite show? I really don't have a favorite show because I don't watch TV like that. Like, I just be on YouTube all the time. Like, really, that's my TV. These flyaways, like, what's really going on? Something you really miss. I really miss my MCM purse with a hundred and something dollars in it that I lost. That's what I miss. I miss my purse and I miss my money, okay? <laughs> Where do you go when you're sad? I try to go somewhere where it's not a lot of people. Um, I just like to be alone. How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? It takes me an hour and 30 minutes. If I really want to like make myself look like something, yeah, I have to get up an hour and 30 minutes early. Have you ever been in a physical fight? Yes, I have been in a physical fight. I was in a physical fight my eighth grade year. And a story time is gonna come with that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it with the people who I got in a fight. Well, not the people that I fought, but the people that I was fighting with. I'm gonna do a story time with them. So stay tuned for that. If y'all wanna see that, comment down below cause I'm a little iffy. I don't know if I really wanna do it yet. What turns me on? Um, 
I like an educated dude. I don't know. I just like somebody educated. Um, I don't have to correct your grammar. Um, I like somebody who who like try to get money, find ways, to, legal ways to get money. I like, um, I love a funny person. Like, if you funny, me and you, we gonna just automatically click anyway because I just love funny people. So those are my top three turn-ons. You gotta be educated, you gotta be a hustler, you gotta be able to get that money, and you gotta be funny. So, yeah, what turns me off? Well, obviously the opposite of what I just said, but other than that, I don't like when boys don't have good hygiene. Like that, no. Like they come to school like crusting their eyes or like, like crust around their mouth or anything like that. It's just like, ah, get away from me. I don't, uh, no. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Quality you look for in a partner. Um, you have to be, you gotta be understanding because I feel like I'm an understanding person. So if you're not understanding, it's just not gonna be, it's just not gonna be that. You gotta be able to talk things out. Of course you gotta be cute, like, you gotta be cute. You gotta be able to dress. It's a lot, it's a lot. I like a lot. <laughs> I be looking for a lot. So I'm not even gonna go through everything, but like, yeah, yeah. What's your favorite color? My favorite color used to be green. Well, it kind of is still green, um, but currently I've been really vibing with orange. I don't know what it is, but I've been really just liking orange lately. So I think that's my new favorite color on top of green because green will forever be my favorite. Loud music or soft? It depends on how I'm feeling. Like sometimes I feel like we build and then other times I feel like I'm a gorilla in a, in a, in a, in a yeah. It just depends on how I'm feeling you did. Like, <laughs> it just depends. Favorite actor. If y'all ever watched The Great Debaters, the um the light-skinned girl, I know she's a Smollett. I don't know her first name. Huh? Journey Smollett. I love her. I, I just love her. I don't know. I fell in love with her after I watched The Great Debaters. The reason you joined YouTube, I joined YouTube because I knew that this is what I wanted to do. Like, I know my mom stopped doing my hair sixth grade, I believe. And that's when I turned to YouTube to like try to find, you know, things to do with my hair. And then that's when I just became addicted. And I knew that I wanted to start my own YouTube channel just by watching other people's YouTube channels. So if that makes sense. I just wanted to do it because I just love YouTube and that's what I wanted to do. So I did it. <laughs> do you have any fears? Yes, I have fears. You're not supposed to have fears, but I have fears. I'm afraid of breaking a bone. I've never broke a bone before in my life. I'm afraid of just getting hurt. Not emotionally hurt, but physically hurt. I'm just afraid, I, yeah, no. Uh -uh. I've never really been physically hurt, so I, I don't I don't wanna feel that. <laughs> so yeah, if anything, that's my biggest fear. I don't wanna be hurt. Last book you read, it's called Night. It's a book um, about the Holocaust. We had to read it in school. Last show you watched, Love & Hip Hop. Yeah, I was in a hair salon yesterday and it was on TV. So yeah. Last place you were. Last place I was, I was in New York. And those vlogs are going up really soon, so stay tuned for that. Last time I said I love someone. Oh, I know, it was yesterday. My ex-mom called me and she was like, I love you. And I was like, I love you too. Last sport you play, I play volleyball for those who don't know and the season is over with, so that counts as the last sport I've played. Who's the last person I talked to? My little brother Josh last night. Not my real little brother, but I got little brothers that I grew up with. Yeah, his name is Josh, so yeah, that's the last person I talked to. Last song you sang, We Don't Love Him. Do I have a crush? I do have a crush. <laughs> the relationship between you and the last person you text. Oh, we don't have a relationship. It's just a friend. Favorite food. My favorite food is pizza. I love pizza. I want pizza right now. Place you want to visit. I want to go to Cali. I want to go to Cali. I've been to Atlanta. I live right here by Atlanta. So I've been to Atlanta. I've been to New York. And I want to go to Cali. I feel like that's just like, it's just a must. You have to go to New York, Cali, and Atlanta. You just have to. What's the last time, well, when was the last time that I kissed someone? It's been some months. 
Last time you were insulted. I get insulted every day on YouTube. All y'all comments gonna get deleted. Like, and y'all be really trying it. Like, what instruments do you play? Um, I played violin when I was in elementary school. That counts. <laughs> Favorite piece of jewelry. I'm really loving this necklace right now, even though it's really cheap. I love it and I have a David Yarman bracelet which my mom had because she had to go get it clean. Those two and my earrings, I love diamond earrings, are my three favorite pieces of jewelry. Last time I hung out with someone, it was a few days ago with my with my cousin. Yeah. What can make me incredibly angry? If you eat my food, like don't eat my food. Don't just don't even go near my food. Like just stay away from Keisha's food, okay? Who is the person who makes you the happiest? I think that would have to be my best friend Erica. I don't know. We just around each other. We just be having a good time. So yeah. What is the cruelest thing you've ever done? Hmm. I don't know. I'm not a cruel person. I don't, I like, nothing even comes to my mind when the cruelest thing I've ever done, like, cruel, cruel. Have you ever cheated on somebody? Have I cheated? <laughs> I don't think so. Yeah, no. I don't think I ever cheated. How often do you cry? I cry, like, every few days. Something makes me cry. I try to go like a week without crying, but it just never works because I'm a crybaby and that's how I express, that's how I express how I feel. I like cry, I just cry. I don't, I don't get angry, but I just cry. <laughs> what is the most embarrassing moment you've experienced when you were in high school? I'm still in high school, but I think getting caught cheating, cheating on the test, that was, that was crazy. But I played it cool because, you know, I'm the cool kid. You know what I'm saying? I just, you know, took my little L. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but nah, nah, for real. That had to be the most embarrassing because I was like, what? You really going to do this in front of the whole class? Like, wow. What is the best compliment you've ever received? I don't know. I get so many compliments on a daily that it's just like, they pretty much all be saying the same stuff. Like, you're pretty. You know what I'm saying? But somebody told me that they admire my ambition and my intelligence and that to right there tops off all the pretty your pretty compliments like wow describe yourself in three words fun beautiful and intelligent yeah yeah baby what is the best punishment slash revenge you suggest for a cheating partner. Um, I've been cheated on twice, so um, I feel like the best revenge is no revenge at all. None, don't even say much. Like, when you find out, don't say much. I mean, what more can you say is already done. Just go ahead and just leave it alone, don't say much, and just break up with them, period. I promise you that is the best revenge. Just going about your business is the best revenge, I promise. Have I ever betrayed a friend? Have you ever been portrayed by a friend? Plenty of times. What is your current relationship status? Single, baby. I'm single. So that pretty much wraps up my TMI video, my TMI tag video. I hope you guys enjoyed getting in my business a little bit, knowing a little bit more about me because I kind of just started off my channel with a tutorial, you know what I'm saying? I didn't really tell too much about myself. So I hope that this helps you guys to know a little bit more about me. If you still got more questions, feel free to drop the questions down. I will do a Q&A video if you guys are interested. Um, if that didn't answer all the questions that y'all wanted to know. And if they aren't too deep, <laughs> I'll answer them. Like I said, this wraps up this video. And thank you guys for watching. If you made it all the way to the end, hit that thumbs up button. And do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Because I'm lit, okay? And you can be lit too if you're watching my stuff, so... We both could be lit if you just hit the subscribe button. You did, you did, you did. So I love all of you and I'll see you guys in the next one. I see that you're doing very well. <laughs> you looking very well.